Hey guys, how's it going? Tatiana and a handful here for you. And I've got a handful of projects for you today. We are working on wood burning and this was actually my very first project for doing any kind of wood burning anything. And I had been wanting to experiment with wood burning for some time now and I finally thought it was the right time. So we are here for you and we're getting this done. This is actually a Christmas gift that I was doing for my father and what better project than a Christmas project, right? So he actually likes the Steelers so I decided to do some like Christmas ornaments that they can put on the tree if they um rather have some wooden ornaments rather rather than breakable ones because I've got dogs and you know things break all the time so I am also clumsy I cannot blame the dogs because I just broke my best friend's ornament <laughs> before the dogs did so anyways let me just go ahead and bring you into the video here I did go ahead and use a wood burning tool that I got for super cheap. It is a beginner wood burning tool because again this was my first project. I had never done this before so I wanted to get something really cheap and see if I even liked it and see if I could deal with it. So I did go ahead and do a couple of practice goes like a couple of days before this and what I did was get a bunch of those pucks that you see there and I did go ahead and practice, practice, and practice. So this wood, wood burning kit came with a couple of different tools and I practiced with a few different ones to see which one I was most comfortable with. And since I didn't know how to use it, I ended up using the one that looks or feels closest to a pencil because that's what I use anyways, is usually pencils, color pencils, whatever. And so that is what worked for me. Again, I did do a little practice run a couple times beforehand. And I do recommend putting a mat underneath if you are wood burning on top of wood. Because, duh, it gets hot. I learned the hard way. <laughs> um, so, and silly me, I have a silicone mat right next to me. I could have just used that. So... Yes, there's a little tip for you. Also, again, this is my first time, so I don't have all the tools. It would have been really, really so much easier. I'm telling you, it would have been so much easier if I had like one of those little Lazy Susans or one of those little table toppers that spin. And I'm sure they have them for arts and crafts. I will actually post that down below in the link so keep a lookout for that if you need one. It, it would make everything so much easier because if you take a look in the video I'm constantly turning it and turning it to make it really comfortable. So if you get one of those that turn back and forth it makes this project so much easier. And it's not even just for wood burning projects, really any project. So I will definitely post that down below, take a look, and this took me, I think, about 30 minutes for one side on this small one, and then I took like another 20 minutes on the back, I did do front and back, and I will go ahead and post a picture for you and let you see that. Um, I did also post another video, or I'm going to post another video, so keep a lookout for that. Um, it is another part to this video where I actually did a plaque instead of just a little Christmas ornament for them that they can reuse. Uh, my father actually got a storage for Christmas, so I decided to make a plaque for his storage that says storage space and me being super cute with the wordplay decided to put storage space instead of stealers so if you want to see how that came out go ahead and click on that next video and go take a look and let me know what you think again it was my first time so I definitely need some tips and 
I am almost done. I really like how this one came out. I did go ahead and paint it later on. So I will try to see if I find some pictures and I will post that here for you so you could see what it looks like when it was done. And I did put a top coat, top clear coat on top as well. So I was really excited about this project. I think it came out way better than I originally thought it was going to to be honest it came out so cute I didn't know if I wanted to use these as Christmas ornaments or add them to the plaque that I made and I think I could have co done a couple of more I could have done a couple more if that's how you say it because I can't speak right <laughs> I think I could have done a couple more and so that way I had extra to put onto the plaque and then the Christmas ornaments like I wanted to and I will post that here so you could see what that looked like before and that's the other side I am so glad I took pictures I didn't think I did and there's the two of them there so you see the two different ones I really enjoyed this project it was super cute and again it took me like 30 minutes for each one so I was there for quite some time just put a movie on in the background and got to it ain't nothing to it but to do it right yes so I'll go ahead and post those links down below take a look they are affiliate links so I get a small commission but it's no extra cost to you I really appreciate it and you guys I see see that we're almost done here I flipped it over and I'm putting the date on here of course you gotta put the date on your project so you know when you did it I have a horrible memory so you know I gotta put the date on everything and this is the plaque that I told you I was working on so go ahead and check out my other video I will post those up here and so that way you can see how that came out because that was definitely a project in itself so I'll see you later Bye.